No, I don't get a vote. I also don't pay rates, which compensates. <laughs> when do you stop being governor? Well, the Premier appointed me for a four-year term, so I would expect at the end of four years I would either step down or be renewed. The, my predecessor served for eight years and his predecessor for 15 years. Do your other decorations have any special symbolism for being a governor or is it some random? No. This goes with the job to some extent, but it's not a decoration. It's a symbol of, uh, of my ties to the sovereign. This is, this is saying that I represent the sovereign in the same way as the ADC says that he works for me. Your Excellency, how many hours a week would you work? We try not to uh, work long hours every day. It wouldn't be unusual to start at about 8.30 in the morning and go through till 10 at night. But we wouldn't want to do that regularly. Hospitals, nurseries, schools, service organisations and clubs, rehabilitation centres, sheltered workshops, homes for the elderly, the places visited in a typical working day by the governor and his wife, sometimes together, sometimes not, bring them into close contact with a remarkable cross-section of people of all ages and at every level of society in New South Wales. With such a large number of visits to fit in, you can imagine the work that goes into planning their busy schedule. So many hands to shake, so many people to meet and greet. From knowing the names of all the officials and what they do, to discussing such a variety of activities, or making a formal speech, it all involves a great deal of thought and preparation. It's very evident just how much the Governor and Lady Martin value the opportunity to meet people from all walks of life. The personal sincerity and warmth reflected in these visits make them memorable events for everyone concerned. And there's no doubt about the pleasure they give to patients, pupils, residents, staff, community workers and organisers alike. And it's a job which is service to other people. I'm not here to enjoy myself. It's not a privilege, it's an obligation. I'm not here to enjoy myself. I'm going to enjoy myself. Well, for a start, we take a long weekend about every fourth or fifth weekend from Thursday to Tuesday and we disappear off the planet. <laughs> I suppose we might have two nights a week on our own. We might sometimes have one or, one or two more, sometimes none at all. And indeed, wet or fine, duty very often calls late in the day, when most of us probably reckon we're entitled to relax. More people to meet, more hands to shake. It might be a concert or an official reception. In the evening, it's more likely to be a formal occasion. But whatever the event, it's another opportunity for the governor and his wife to meet the people and share in the everyday life of our state.